Science rules. So I am going to go ahead and document this exciting process. I have decided to become a mother cell. So I am going to asexually reproduce going through the cycle of mitosis. And I'm gonna document the whole thing so all my followers can see. So the first thing I need to do to prep to become a mother cell, to create my daughter cells, so excited, it's hashtag girl mom. The first thing I need to do is start prophase, which is the first phase of mitosis. Prophase is a little bit uncomfortable because all of the chromosomes inside of me are condensing. They're getting really small and they're coming together and everything is spindling up so I can have structures to be able to divide. So everything is just getting a lot tighter right now and it's really, really intense. Prophase is not easy, guys. Whew. Now that prophase is done, I'm just feeling very centered, very lined up because I've entered into metaphase. And in metaphase, things are just lining up directly in the middle of my cell, getting organized and prepared to create my daughter cell. Ooh, anaphase is the most intense after the metaphase because now things are starting to pull really far apart and separate. I can feel my daughter cell. She's gonna emerge really soon. Ooh, I've entered into telephase now where I'm starting to separate and my clone is being completed. Um, our nuclear envelope is starting to form around each other oh, and our, um, our nucleus is appearing and we're becoming our own individual clone of one another. <laughs> I am so proud and so excited to finally be a mother cell. Here she is. We have completed mitosis and now we have two genetically identical versions of me. I'm the mother and she's the daughter cell. And I'm so proud and I can't wait to undergo the process again so I can have another daughter. Thanks for following. As you can see, my family has grown and grown through undergoing mitosis over and over. And now I have all these lovely daughter cells surrounding me and I'll never be alone again. What did the cell say to his sister when she stepped on his toe? I don't know, what'd she say? Mitosis! <laughs> <laughs> Um, there was this one time at school and, and I told, um, this mitosis joke and I thought it was hilarious, but the class, well, they were divided. <laughs> <laughs> My sister went through a phase where she spontaneously split down the middle, making two identical copies. Now they are my one sis and my tosis. <laughs> hey. Uh. Well there, little lady, what's wrong? My Teacher didn't teach me this stuff and I failed my science test. Aww. Well, what was it about? I don't know, reproduction or something. Okay, was it your asexual reproduction or sexual reproduction? I don't even know anything about that. Well, me either. I don't know about any type of reproduction. Maybe Uncle Joey does. <laughs> Uh, Uncle Joey, I, it talks about both a little bit. I just, I don't understand.
understand. Well, I'm gonna get Uncle Joey to tell you about it. All right, so let's see here. Do you get to take your test again? Or are you stuck with this yucky grade? He says that if I study and I get this form signed, that I can retake it. Well, first you better get Papa Danny to sign that form. Papa Danny. Hand it over. All right, well, prophase is the first phase of mitosis. And in the prophase, right, number one, pro, 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 the chromosomes in the nucleus condense. That means they get smaller and they come together and they start to make fibers at the ends of the cell. So it's very first part and it starts to make that DNA replication. Do you know what DNA is? Deoxy something. We don't care about the words. Do you know what it is? No. You better take it from here. Have mercy. <laughs> All right. So DNA is what makes you, you, Michelle, right? So <clears throat> it makes your hair blonde. It makes your uh, feet big or small, you know? It kind of just tells you if you're a girl or a boy too, right? So after the first step, oh, have mercy. I haven't done this in so long, so please excuse me, guys. All right. Pro-metaphase is the next phase, right? It's when the nuclear envelope around the chromosome breaks down. Now, there is no nucleus and the sister chromatids are free. And proteins reach across from the opposite poles of the cell and attach to each kinetosome. Okay, that's prometaphase. That's like the halfway point in between prophase and metaphase, right? Now, whew, I haven't done this in a long time, as you can see. I'm more worried about my hair than this school stuff, but I'm trying to help you pass your test, Michelle, you know? Yeah, I know. Metaphase is your next one. So during the metaphase is when your sister chromatids are aligned. So they're straight up and down. And they start pushing and pulling at each other so that the attached kin kin kinetosaur. kinetosaurs, microtubulars, um, are pretty much in a game of tug of war. So they're pulling at each other and then they finally, when they finally start coming apart after the, after everything and they start their division. And after that phase, they go into the anaphase. So do you want to explain that one? Do you remember anything about that anaphase, little Michelle, or have you forgotten it all? It's just so many big words. I agree. That anaphase is when they just split apart. So those two different little uh, cells, those chromatids, those sisters, it would be like if you and Stephanie just split apart from each other, right? And so you split apart. And then, um, and then once you've done that, you become, they become longer and they stretch, right? And that takes them into the last phases, right? The last phase is called the telophase. And uh, this is when the cell itself <laughs> is ready to completely divide. And it's like, they become identical <laughs> twins. Michelle, have you ever met any identical twins before? Hmm. The voice. Exactly. Uncle Jay down there, he knows all about those identical twins because he's got a couple wily ones himself. So basically, the cells create identical twins and they are sister cells. And that is mitosis. <laughs> that Saki's so wild. <laughs>
Oh, thanks, guys. I have a lot of studying to do. Well, just know we're here to help you, you know, anytime you need. Thanks. What am I doing my hair? Science Crew. Science Rule.